The Republican fight for the 2016 presidential nomination could very well pit two close Florida friends against each other. One well, America's D.C. contributor, David Brody, has more on what a Jeb Bush, Marco Rubio duel would look like. Think of it as a teacher-student relationship. Jeb Bush in the role of the teacher, Marco Rubio the student. Both from Florida politics, both laying down roots in the Hispanic Miami area, and now both looking like they're getting ready to run for president. The former Florida governor has plenty of admiration for the younger Rubio. He even called him the best vice presidential candidate a couple years ago. Marco Rubio is my favorite because uh, we have a close relationship. I admire him greatly. He's probably the most articulate conservative uh, elected official on the scene today. But it is Jeb Bush who seems to have the early lead among Florida lawmakers. So far, he's got the backing of five GOP members in the House. Rubio has just one. There's still a long time to go, but it shows how Bush's longtime political network and relationships will put Rubio at a disadvantage. Even Rubio acknowledges that he'd be going up against a political juggernaut. As far as my thinking, look, I think Jeb Bush is going to be a very credible candidate. I think he's going to raise a lot of money. I saw recent projections that he's going to raise $100 million or so. I think he can easily do that and more. He's got an extraordinary network of donors around the country. and. And I know that he'll be a strong candidate if he runs. Rubio has also called Bush the man he most admires in Florida politics. If Rubio runs, he has made clear that he will have a strong base of financial supporters and that his policies will not be a carbon copy of Bush, though he's not giving specifics right now. In addition, he recently said that he believes it's time for a new generation of leadership in this country, and that is a theme he will be sure to hit on if he runs. David Brody, One American News, Washington.